Hey guys, um, some people requested me to do some example solves of how of how I would solve the Mega Minx. So I'm gonna do two solves and show you what I would have done. So yeah, <coughs> the first thing I see on this scramble is the white uh, star edges. This one, this one, this one, and this one, and then another another one right here, right there. Sorry. And uh, yeah. For this, I would probably do something like this, put that down, move it over there, put the next one down, and this one at the same time, and then this one, like that, while moving this one there, over there, and then just finishing it off. So yeah, and when we have the star, I would look for the of 12 pieces. The first thing I would see is these two. So I would connect those. And then I would insert them. And I see this edge. And I'm gonna keep track of that. Then as I look through this side, I see these two. Very easy to match up. And I also see this corner. And I knew that this edge was here. So I insert that. At the same time I know how to do these two. And now I see these two, and these two. And so the next thing I would have done is probably that, and then connect those two. And I see these two are close together. And I would insert that. And now do the last two pieces. Last F12 pair. So that's the F12. The next thing I would do is the purple side. I would start by seeing this edge piece and these two this these two uh, corner edge pairs so yeah just connect those two and insert them then I would see that this edge is over here so I would insert that in there and then do these two pieces insert them and now I see this corner, this edge, connect, insert, easy as that. And yeah, next thing I would see is this edge, and I'm gonna do the yellow side, so this edge, and these, this corner, this edge. So I would start by inserting that, and then solving those by doing something like this, I guess. And then I see these two. And I would move that over there, connect them, insert. And then I would see this already made, uh, connected pair. And I would insert it, then insert the edge on the blue side, that is. And then these two are pretty easy as well, just connect like that, insert. And then <coughs> I would, on the last side, I would start by inserting the red edge then start with the easiest pair I can see, which is these two, just do that. Then uh, I would move that over there like that, do this pair, which would go here, do that pair, then uh, undo that move, then do the last pair. Then I would do, oh sorry, then I would do um, edge of then corner OL, and in this case I don't know the PLL, so I would just do corner permutation, and, oh, edge permutation, then corner permutation, and that's all, so, and next scramble, <coughs> and this really isn't a beginner's walkthrough, I guess. So you should be quite advanced to be learning from this, I guess. But since so many people in, um, requested it, I thought it would be cool to make one. So. There we go. Um, now I see these two white edges and this white edge. And... Um, this one as well, and this one. So, 
what I would do is I would <coughs> start by solving the blue and the yellow like that then solve the red while I'm at it so like that move that so, so it connects with the pieces and then do the last two like that so it's quite an easy start and then the first thing I would see is these two and these two so I would start by connecting these two and keep an eye on the keeping an eye on this one insert it and solve that one and you see on the Mega Minx you don't really have to worry about how the pieces are connected you can just do them on another layer because there's so many layers you won't disturb anything so for this piece you wouldn't have to do something like that you could just move it down there and it's like an easy 3 move insertion so yeah next thing I would see is the blue and yellow and the blue and yellow so I would solve that by doing something like this and as I was doing that I saw this edge and this corner so I would solve those as well so it's a lot about tracking pieces I see this one now and yeah so that try to find the edge which is down here and just insert it F12 done I move on to the purple I see this one and this one I would just insert those two and then I guess do this pair because I saw those edges first those pieces first and now I see these two it will be quite easy like that and the last one <coughs> just insert like that and um, now I see this one and this one pair, pair up like that and just insert like that then the other ones are here so yeah blue side these two again that's a case where you can just use the different sides to yeah make it easier I guess so yeah now I see these two just connect them and insert so now I would do this edge the red edge like that so these two this is the easiest I saw then so this and then I would move this out of the way so it's a three move insertion instead of getting this I would already get this so it's like cancelling a move and then I get edge orientation and uh, corner, corner orientation and I don't know this PLL either so Solve it like this: edge permutation, corner permutation. So there. Um, I might make another one of these if this one doesn't turn out as good as I want to, but we'll see. You can also check out my last layer guide. It's going to be an advanced guide, but not like too many PLs and stuff. Just what I would do. If I wouldn't want to learn 152 PLL algs. So, yeah, check that out, and yeah, thanks for watching.